Have you ever pondered the ripple effects of globalization on businesses? How about the role of the Global South in shaping the future of commerce? These pressing questions were the focus of the B20 Summit held in New Delhi, India in the year 2023. Dr. S. Jay Shankar, the Honorable Minister of External Affairs, Government of India, took center stage at the summit, discussing the importance of strategic autonomy in our volatile world. He argued that the pursuit of a just, equitable and participative global order hinges on commensurate investment in trade and technology decisions. During his speech, Dr. Jaishankar traced the evolution of the global world order. It began with political implications, gradually accruing economic connotations and was further accelerated by globalization. Technology, energy resources, connectivity and human ingenuity have all played a part. In the present day, Dr. Jaishankar emphasized the importance of focusing on developing countries for ensuring global food, energy, and fertilizer security. He also noted the impact of trade disruptions, high interest rates, and climate events due to the COVID pandemic and Ukraine crisis. He noted increasing climate events have contributed additional factors of stress. The current focus on the Global South emanates from the conviction that these are countries that are truly deserving of special care. These are also societies under exceptional stress which, if left unaddressed, would become a serious issue in the world economy. The concerns of 125 countries, voiced during the Global South Summit in January 2023, have become central to the G20 agenda. During India's G20 presidency, Discussions pivoted around debt and finance in sustainable development, climate action, food security, and women-led development. Dr. Jaishankar articulated that the mandate of the G20 is to promote economic growth and development. However, he maintained that this cannot advance if the crucial concerns of the Global South are not addressed. He envisioned the emerging world 2.0 as a place with more engines of growth, a fair distribution of the benefits of globalization, and greater resources devoted to attaining sustainable development goals, promoting climate action and justice. Recognizing the B20 Engagement Group's efforts, Dr. Jay Shankar praised them for prioritizing inclusive growth, resilient supply chain, services trade, digital technologies, innovation, and sustainability. He affirmed that the engagement group has established itself as a credible partner of governments working towards the same ends. In the words of Dr. Jai Shankar, the task forces and action councils have given a practical articulation to what the world must do. In essence, globalization should be diversified and democratic, with multiple centers of production where businesses can make a difference.